Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And T Mobile once again is pushing into rural America with more hometown grants. So, 25 new towns selected to receive T Mobile's hometown grant for local initiatives, you know, such as fixing up the local park, community center, whatever it may be. It, it, it helps that, that community, and you can apply for it. Of course, all of that will be in the description down below and i'll leave the the article to that to this uh the link to this article in the description down below now again it seems it really seems that no matter how you look at it right as t-mobile is continuing to mature they're beating the competition at every point they're trying to stay ahead of the competition and in some cases two to three steps ahead of the competition right t-mobile is continuing to aggressively move into rural America with different marketing strategies, with with uh, different initiatives, and this again is going to help the local initiatives, and it pu- it's going to put T-Mobile, you know, on a certain level with the consumer base locally, right? A lot of them may have used Verizon and AT and T. They may have been tired of the higher pricing. They may have had to deal with Verizon's customer service, and now T-Mobile comes in and they're like, "Look, we have service." We're going to help you guys with a local initiative. It's going to look really good on T-Mobile's resume as they move into these areas, right? And then these uh, new retail locations are are moving in as well with retail distribution for T-Mobile. And a lot of the customers in these smaller areas have seen T-Mobile's advertising one way or another, and they may not be inclined to move to T-Mobile. Right. So this is another way. And it seems to be working because T-Mobile is not stopping it. Right. This is already like, I think, the third or fourth round of local initiatives that they've done. Right. It says it right here. T-Mobile has now given seven point eight million to one hundred and seventy five rural communities across 41 states. So this is working. They started this very early on in the merger. They, They announced it. And it's just been scaling each and every year. And they continue to do these hometown grants. So it must be working. If it wasn't working, T-Mobile would have stopped it a long time ago. So just wanted to share that with you guys. T-Mobile is continuing their push into into, uh, rural America. Again, far from anything dominant. They have to... They have to build that network. That is that 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 has to be the first priority. Before you do anything, you got to have a substantial network footprint where you are confident enough as T-Mobile that you can win share in those areas. And they seem to be doing doing that at a at a very good clip. So I hope we get an update at the Q1 earnings call because it looks like they're taking they're taking more share very quickly. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel for more. Like, share, subscribe, follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Life. See you in the next one. Peace.